Forever Green presents 10 of the world's strangest plants. The Venus Flytrap. The Venus Flytrap is the most famous of all carnivorous plants due to the active and efficient nature of its unique traps. It may be famous, but it's also threatened. The plant's two hinged leaves are covered in ultra-sensitive fine hairs that detect the presence of everything from ants to arachnids. Triggers the hairs and snap! The trap will shut in less than a second. The Dancing Plant Darwin called this plant Hadeserum, but it is also known as the Dancing Grass or Telegraph Plant, typically found in many tropical countries such as Bangladesh, India, Pakistan, China, and Sri Lanka. The most important thing about this is that it moves when stimulated by sound. It is suggested that the reaction to sound could occur to mimic butterfly movement or general winged anthropod mimicry to attract other species. The leaflets of the dancing plant visibly move in an elliptical fashion when exposed to high frequency sound waves. This movement can last for up to three to five minutes. The Dragon Blood Tree. There are many beautiful, interesting, and strange plants that exist on our planet. One very unusual species among these is the Dragon Blood Tree from Socotra Island. This tree not only has a very distinctive appearance, but also releases a red resin that is known as dragon's blood. According to locals, the first Dragon Blood Tree was created from the blood of a dragon that was wounded when it fought an elephant. Like the unfortunate dragon, the tree secretes its resin when it's injured. In ancient times, the resin was believed to have magical and medicinal properties. People used it as a pigment for art, a dye, and a medicine. Dragon's blood is still used for these purposes today. The Corpse Plant A flower taller than a man, stinking strongly of putrefying roadkill and colored deep burgundy to mimic rotting flesh. Sounds like something from a low-budget science fiction movie. But Indonesia's Titan Aram, or corpse flower, as known by locals, is a real phenomenon, pollinated in the wild by carrion-seeking insects. This Indonesian plant has the world's biggest inflorescence. Due to its fragrance, which is reminiscent of the smell of a decomposing mammal, the Titan Aram is also known as a carrion flower, the corpse flower, or corpse plant. The Bottle Tree Baobab is the common name for a genus containing eight species of trees, native to Madagascar, mainland Africa, and Australia. Also known as the Bottle Tree, not only do they look like bottles, but the trees typically store around 300 liters of water. No wonder why they often live over 500 years. The Shy Plant Mimosa pudica, or the sensitive plant, has a curiosity value. The compound leaves fold inward and droop when touched or shaken, reopening within minutes. The species is native to South America and Central America, but is now a pantropical weed. Who would know that plants have feelings too? The most resistant plant. It's not pretty to look at, but Namibia's plant, Wewistia mirabilis, can truly claim to be one of a kind. Most important thing of this plant is that their estimated lifespan is 400 to 1500 years. This plant consists of only two leaves and a sturdy stem with roots. That's all. Two leaves continue to grow until they resemble the odd mane of some science fiction alien. It can even survive up to five years without any water. The plant is said to be very tasty either raw or baked in hot ashes, and this is how it got its other name, Anyanga, which means onion of the dessert. The Resurrection Plant Also known as Rose of Jericho, the Seligonella lepidophila is a species of desert plant noted for its ability to survive almost complete desiccation. During dry weather in its native habitat, its stems curl into a tight ball and uncurl when exposed to moisture. 
world's largest flower. There is one exotic and rare plant you wouldn't likely want to grow anywhere near your landscape, no matter how famous it would make you for doing so. That would be growing the largest flower in the world. This exotic, very rare, speckled, though not particularly pretty, rust-colored flower is called Raffaliesa arnaldi, which is the biggest individually produced flower in the world. It gets to be three feet across and weighing a whopping 15 to 24 pounds. That's pretty darn big, but still you would not like this flower in your perennial bed. Why is that? If you could mimic a rainforest type environment for this plant, it gives off a most offensive odor when in bloom. This scent is somewhat like rotting meat. This is why it is often called the corpse plant by some natives of Indonesia where it originates. Its blossoms only last three to five days, but in those few days, it needs a miracle for survival. This hideous smell it produces attracts pollinating insects to it to help perpetuate the species. But even when this happens, only 10 to 20% of the tiny seedlings make it. The baseball plant, Euphorbia obesa, also known as the baseball plant, is endemic to the Great Karoo region of South Africa, which means it cannot be found anywhere else. Baseball plant is named after the shape of the stem and brown tubercles on the ribs that altogether create impression of a ball that is used for baseball. Unsustainable harvesting by plant collectors who value Euphorbia obesa for its interesting and curious appearance has severely impacted its wild populations. While Euphorbia obesa remains endangered in its native habitat, it has become very common in cultivation. By growing large numbers of Euphorbia obesa, nurseries and botanical gardens have been working to ensure that specimens being traded and sold among plant collectors are not obtained from the wild. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe to Forever Green.